Yo! What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is your boy, Kevin, also known as KP. We're not in my room. We're not playing games today. We are out here at Universal Studios Hollywood. And not just regular Universal Studios, we're here for Halloween Horror Nights. I don't know why it keeps blurring on me. I'm bringing you guys with me for the 300 subscribers that we've reached. Finally, we're at 300 subscribers, currently at 310, I believe. Y'all ready? Okay, let's go into the early entrance. Check out the view, though. <laughs> Y'all, look at this. Yo, this is lit. Holy shit. That's fucking lit. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. Christmas ornament in Halloween? What? <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Bruh. Krampus? Yo. <laughs> Bruh, look at Santa. <laughs> Mood. Okay, this is freaking awesome, and it's about time they think about the people. <laughs> Look at this. They got tables now. This is new, you guys. They finally put tables for everybody to sit in because I remember last year there was no tables for us to sit in, and it's about time. That looks freaking badass. Oh my goodness. So, this is what's happening right now. I didn't get into any of the mazes because everything is like super packed right now and I picked up the express pass and the express pass is only good for one time at every maze so every maze right now for general like regular regular ticket is like at least an hour and I was like yo I might as well just chill because it's not even worth it you know no it's exactly what we need to start off the night Blue Moon, sponsor me. <laughs> We're about to go into The Walking Dead. Been here plenty of times already, but let's do this. Hey, thank you. You too. Hey. Oh my gosh. Look at him. Oh, the second part is. Already going in trick or treat, guys. What the hell? Okay, toxic tunnel at night. 
bunch of strobe lights. Epilepsy warning, you guys. Scary dude. That actually scared me, dog. Out of all the damn mazes, that shit scared me, dude. <laughs> Back in here. Back in the rape. Alright guys, so I am back in my car right now. I'm about to end the vlog right here. As you can tell, I'm kind of losing my voice a little bit. Well, actually not really. Uh, I feel like my voice is a little scratchy right now. And I'm like losing it because honestly it was a lot of fun. I definitely recommend anybody to come to Halloween Horror Nights. I'm freaking exhausted right now. Um, I got a couple of shots. Um, inside Horror Nights and a couple of shots inside a couple of the mazes also um, I wasn't able to Give you guys like my thoughts on the maze after every maze and all that because Inside Horror Nights it was super crowded and I wouldn't have gone into every of the like I wouldn't have gone into all of the mazes if it wasn't for the Express Pass the Express Pass goes for like 189 it's definitely worth it. It's so freaking worth it because for a general line to wait for a maze, we're talking like 150 minutes. It's ridiculous, y'all. But like I said, get the Express Pass. It's definitely worth it. Um, honestly, I enjoyed this. I enjoyed this year. Uh, I did. I really, really liked Blumhouse. Blumhouse, is, it was a really good maze for me. Uh, I also liked Halloween 4, Stranger Things. Okay, Stranger Things to me wasn't scary. The amount of work that was put into Stranger Things and how it looks is super insane. Like, it looks freaking crazy in, it, in a good way though. It looks really good. And I enjoyed that. I didn't get scared at all because I was just amazed at the fact that it looks so damn good. Stranger Things is definitely a must. If you go to Horror Nights, um, first maze that you want to get into, get into is Stranger Things because Stranger Things has a really long wait time. So get there soon, and I recommend getting in getting in for uh, getting in early entrance. Early entrance is usually from five to six thirty, and then they close it, and then you have to wait for the ceremony. And then after that, that's when everybody goes in, and then you just gotta run to Stranger Things. But definitely recommend getting into. Uh, Getting into early entrance for Stranger Things. Trick or Treat was also a really good maze. I was, uh, the Purge was also, it was pretty good. It was all right. Um, it's definitely, I think it would be like under all of the other mazes to me. I really appreciate all the mazes. Like the amount of work that every, like all the people put in to make these mazes are insane. And I've been coming here since like 2013, 2014. 
and to see everything that has changed from year to year how everything looks now it looks insane like everything looks so good i recommend anybody to to come to halloween horror nights and if you do i recommend getting the express pass it doesn't matter if you don't get it uh just figure out a system of how you can get into every single maze like i said if you don't get the express pass then go in for early entrance and then try and get into as many mazes as you can from there today was a really good day i'm exhausted i'm gonna get home and I'm gonna eat something and I'm just gonna knock out because tomorrow I gotta get up early. I also have to edit this video and I, I also have some homework. Today was a really good day. I'm happy. We had reached 300 subscribers, so this goes out to all of you. And I love y'all. Thank you for the support. Thank you for subscribing to me and everything that you guys do. It's awesome. And I know this 300 subscriber thing video is late, but honestly, better late than never, right? So yeah, anyways, it's been your boy Kevin, and I'll see all of y'all in the next one. Peace.